This is Duke University. My name is Len White, and I'm an associate professor in the Duke University School of Medicine and the Duke Institute for Brain Sciences. I'm also the instructor for a Coursera course designed for students in the health professions called Medical Neuroscience. Now, I'm excited to bring you the core elements of medical neuroscience in a new Coursera offering called Foundational Neuroscience for Perception and Action. This course is designed to provide an understanding of basic neuroscience so that you can be successful in our Coursera specialization that we're calling Perception, Action, in the Brain. So here's what you can expect from me in this course. You will learn about how nerve cells generate electrical signals, how they interact at synaptic junctions, and how those interactions change with use as we make new memories and acquire new skills. Much of this course will focus on the organization and physiology of the neural systems in the human brain and spinal cord that generate perceptions and actions. We will learn about the senses of touch, pain, vision, hearing, body position, and balance. And we will consider how our motor systems integrate this sensory input to generate actions, that is, movement of body, mind, and our emotion. To provide an anatomical framework for your learning, we will consider together the anatomy of the human brain, what many of us consider to be the most complex structure in the universe. You will learn the overall organization of this incredible organ, and you will explore its various parts, including this magnificent cerebral cortex. Along the way, we will study the means by which its neural networks integrate sensory experience and motivate bodily actions. Throughout the course, I want to challenge you to learn actively. And one terrific way to do so is to make your knowledge of the human brain visible. One easy way to do that is through drawings, like this one. You may find some other form of representation that will be just as effective in making your knowledge both visible and tangible. But with active learning exercises like this, I hope that you will be deeply engaged by the content of this course as we together focus on the brain mechanisms of perception and action. You may be wondering whether you should enroll in this shorter course or its parent, medical neuroscience. If you are in the health professions, or a student aspiring to the health professions, then medical neuroscience is definitely the course for you. It's longer in duration and broader in scope, consistent with the rigors of medical education. On the other hand, if your interests are not so clinical and mainly focused on the human brain and the fundamentals of neuroscience, or maybe you just don't have time and space in your life for the larger course, then this shorter course is my recommendation for you. But either way, one course or the other will fulfill the requirement from me for our specialization. You certainly don't need to take both. So I hope to see many of you in Foundational Neuroscience for Perception and Action. I can't wait to get started as we explore together the fascinating neural mechanisms that the brain uses to create our sensory perceptions and govern our behavior. Produced by Duke University. Online at duke.edu.